Hello to anyone watching, and uh, this is Nathan Plays Far Cry 4. So, I wanted to do a full playthrough blind, but this isn't, this first episode isn't. So, it's okay though, because everything I'm going to say is still going to be garbled as hell. So, you know, and I've forgotten what I said the first time. So it's pretty much a blind thing, although I do know what happens. Hmm. Anyway. Ajay, my son. I have but one last wish. Take me back to Lakshmana. <sighs> What a beautiful fucking area. Mr. Gale, this is Chad Peterson from the U.S. Embassy here in Patna. Uh, I'm calling you pursuant to the application for a tourist visa for India with further travel to Karat. We can only accept your status as a U.S. citizen as we have no official records regarding your Karate citizenship. Furthermore, I must legally advise you against traveling into Karat. We have no official diplomatic presence in Karat due to the civil unrest with the Golden Path. In regards to your intent to bring with you the cremated remains of one Ishwari Gale, you will need to bring with you the passport for the deceased, the original and copy of the Hmm. Passport. Okay. You do the talking. I'll just sit here and pet my monkey friend. Oh, yep, definitely. Gotta bribe him. <gasps> Okay, remember. 100% legal. Fuck off, monkey. What's happening? That's a lot of people with guns. I wonder what they are going to do with them. Perhaps go absolutely ape shit. Oh yeah, you guys just run away, why don't you? Genius plan. And then you just sort of stand facing sideways, shooting your gun, and you didn't even kill that guy, and- ah! <laughs> Monkey friend! And man friend! Right, let's just- Okay. Hello. Hello. You look quite badly injured. I'm just gonna do whatever the guy with the gun says. That's generally good advice. And no one saw that coming. <laughs> Seriously, oh, he's the only person who owns a fucking helicopter. He's also a little bit crazy. Who knew? I distinctly remember saying, Stop the bus. Yes, stop the bus. Stop, shoot the bus. I'm very particular with my words. Stop, shoot. Stop, shoot. Do those words sound the same? That it got out of control. I'm sorry, I didn't hear you. What'd you say? It got out of control. Got out of control. I hate when things get out of control. Oh! One fucking job, but you couldn't fucking do that! And I got blood on my fucking shoes. Uh huh. Hi. At least there's a silver lining. We didn't completely fuck it up. Get up, boy. Recognize those eyes anywhere. <laughs> I'm so sorry about this. This was supposed to be 
No, not this. We have a party waiting for you. But I don't think I know your name. Who is this? Hmm? Is this your plus one? <laughs> well, Monkey was supposed to be my plus one. Yeah, definitely. Strong. Terribly embarrassed about all of this. This was supposed to be very simple, but you know, if you give food to monkeys, they just throw their shit at each other. You know. Oh, would you hold this? So, by all means. Picture right into the camera. There we are. Cheese. Awesome. Thanks. <laughs> A thing, my boy. This will soon be behind us, and we'll be off on our grand adventure. Because I have cleared my calendar for you. You and I are gonna tear shit up. Yes. You know what I want? This sounds like we're gonna be on his side, right? How cool would that game be if you got to be like with a supervillain? How good would that be? I mean, you'd be pretty fucked up, but a lot of games are fucked up. I must say, Paul, your little corner of Kirati is rather beautiful. I expected more chains and wailing, but knowing you somewhere around here is a dark place where the secrets flow like the blood. <laughs> that wry smile betrays you again, Duplur. <laughs> Well, go on, take the bloody bag off his head. Again, terribly sorry for what happened before. This is more what I had in mind. So, fresh start, introductions. RJ Gale, our guest of honor. Paul, our very gracious host. The little monkey, whose name I still don't know. And I, of course, am Hagen Ming. You really don't remember me, do you? Your mother, she never spoke of me, never mentioned me to you. No. We'll change all that. Paul, I need cash. Uh, how much do you need? All of it. Thank you. Here we go. Hmm? All right. Look at this with the smile. <clears throat> That's you. That's... Well, I'm not so sure anymore. Now, your mother, your mother, on the hey. other hand, she understood me. She knew me in a way that no one ever did. Ew, okay. Back. Weird. The last time I saw Ishwari was years ago. She told me she loved me. Women, they can do that. They can tell you they love you in a moment and mean it. Men, on the other hand, no, men only really too much distance has built up. So, when your mother decided to flee to the United States with you on her hip, I couldn't help but blame myself. Then I realized, it's not me, no. It was the fucking golden path. <laughs> Those fucking terrorists, they ruin everything. It's like dinner. Did no one ever teach you that it's rude to text at the table? Let's see here. Let's beat the fun. Really, guys? We're not checking for these anymore? He was pretty smooth, though. RJ Gale. You'll love this part. Help. <laughs> A text for help. You don't text for help. You cry for help. So come on, you're going to cry for help. You're going to do something, you're going to do it right. Here we go. Oh, Jesus. Cry for help. Cry for help. Help. Oh, pathetic. No, cry for help. Help. You mean it, boy. Help. help. From your diaphragm. Help. 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 Shh, 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 shh. Now we listen. Nothing. I'm afraid they're not coming for you, buddy. <laughs> oh. Find out what he knows. <laughs> Terrorists, right? Now... Please, stay right here. Enjoy the crab rangoon. Don't move. I will be right back. Yuma, we need to talk. Okay, then. 
I'm just going to take my uh, the ashes of my mother back, and uh, I'll be on my way. Okay, white man's gone. Um, I'll be leaving, please. Yeah, I, I don't want to explore here. I want to leave a lot. That sounds like an execution. <laughs> Let's check it out, shall we? Oh, white man's still here. You're a terrible listener. Now, we already know you've been spying on compounds. So how do you know Aj Gale? He's my What does the gold do? Nothing. How fucked up are you? You're worse than Pagan. You are worse than him. You're sick. You're sick. No one cares about your company. No. No. Leaving. Let's kill this motherfucker. Hello, friend. safely no matter the cost Darpan would understand no I want to save him from that douchebag's company Shit, they know we're here. The door, quickly. okay can I have a gun RJ, with these doors open I need you to keep your head down and make a run for the truck move as fast as you can okay but can I can I have a gun please Unarmed it is then. I guess we're not really that worried about my welfare. Yeah, here we go. Unarmed. Let's do this. Oh, gee, and they have explosives. How is this fair? Ah, oh, Jesus. Let's go. Come on. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, great experience. That's an elephant. Let's just keep driving, shall we? Yeah. What is wrong with you people? That, why is he on fire? Oh, now I get a gun. Now I'm in a vehicle. Hey, friends. Um, that's what I wanted to do. No, it's fine. RJ, RJ, just chill, okay? You're not chilling enough. Okay, let's try not to fall off anything. I'll just dig this bullet out of my arm. It's about the third one. 10 pints of blood. There he goes. Where's... Oh no! Oh no! Ow! Ah! <laughs> Why me? Unnecessary! I don't even know how I'm alive if I'm honest. He's not. He's definitely not alive. That's me. Hello? Thank you. This is about 
found. Where are you? I don't know. Fuck. The driver's dead. <sighs> okay, listen to me. Look around. You should be able to see a tower nearby. I need you to make your way there. I'm on my way to secure it now. Head to the tower. Okay. You can do this, Ajay. I'm not sure about that one. Don't. No, no, not in the bushes. Not in the bushes. Just... I know! But I don't know what the hell Pagan will do. Probably molest me or something. He said I had my mother's eyes. And he is fucking insane. Run, run, run. Oh, that was clever. Um... No, die, t take it. This is, this is all of the bad. They're not gonna find me. They don't know. They are unable to see through water. A clear substance. They can't see through it. I am a stealth master. Clearly, after that performance, I should just go ahead and do a, play a whole playthrough of Dishonored without getting seen once, because that's how good I am. Fuck this animal. Give me its insides and its flesh. Ah ha ha! I'm a fucked up person. I believe there is a bear. Hello, bear friend. Eh, uh, is he dead? Bear friend is the best friend I could ever ask for. Oh shit! Oh no! Oh no! Okay. Yep, you just... I'm your friend. Bear friend. Bear friend. Bear friend. Bear friend! Good old bear friend. He totally didn't want to kill me just then. I am 100% certain of it. I would put my life in d bear friend's hands. Fuck you, birds. I just got a maxi pad. That's freaking wonderful. <laughs> oh, and money. Excellent. And throwing knife. All of this is good. That cougar, man. He is effective. Oh, and that's not a good thing. Okay, he's not that effective. Give me money. Undershirts. Fucking wonderful. Just what I needed. What? Regardless, next time I can promise you a better spread. That's the last time I'm kidnapping a fucking TV celebrity chef. What? Why would you kill a celebrity chef just because I ran away? I didn't run away because of the freaking Rangu. I ran away because of the company. Which was not only awful. But psychotic as well. Give me skins. Ah, blue dot. That always means friend. Hello? Hi. Okay. Okay. It's cool. I am amazing at reverse abseiling. Let's do this. Bo Boing! Boing! No, okay, fine. It's an honor to meet you, son of Mohan. I'm amazed you made it all the way here on your own. Sabal is waiting for you near the tower. Uh, it's nothing, I'm a ninja. You wouldn't understand, babe. You've never had the responsibilities of being the son of someone who is apparently quite good in the Golden Path, which is a group of apparently terrorists who are fighting against someone who's quite evil. She just wouldn't understand. Hey, friends. Good job, son of ah, you're an important person. You're the son of Mohan Gali. You may not know it, but that name carries a lot of weight in Kirat, especially for the Golden Path. Are those army guys still looking for me? Pagan men will stop at nothing to get you back. Damn. Oh no. Oh no. What? 
They have grenades. I didn't even know they had grenades. That's right. Just fix, pull the shrapnel out of your arm. That will always stop the bleeding. <laughs> okay, now we're fine. Oh, that guy's gonna... We should probably kill him. Gents, you're not doing a great job of uh, protecting me and I just killed one of your people. Oh, you get minus karma points. I think I just went below zero in karma. Okay, um, the best thing to do at this point would be for everyone, for everyone to just charge this way. Yeah, friend, I'll follow you to the end. Oh, no. <laughs> I love that. The first time I played this, I genuinely followed them to try and save myself from the avalanche rather than hiding in the building. Like a genius. Yeah, I survived the avalanche somehow. Don't ask. Clearly I'm just too good. At everything. Quite cold though. You're a tough man to kill, brother. That's a good thing, right? Yes. Let's keep going. Amita and Sabal. I know who they are now. First time, didn't have a clue. So now I'm more enlightened. That's a great thing, right? How did you know to find me? He saw Bacon's chopper nearby. He's never down this far south, and I wanted to know why. Lucky for you, we were in the area when we got Darkman's text. Well, we're here. Welcome to Banapur. Who's this? Where's Darpen? He didn't make it. This is Ajay Gale. Mohan's son. Let me understand. Darpen's dead? Yep. For me. I'm not involved in, in whatever this is. I'm just looking for Lakshmana. We're in the middle of a fucking war. We don't have time for tourists. Such language. I'm sorry, brother. Amita's a little touchy. I'll talk to her. As for Lakshmana, it sounds like it could be a temple or shrine. But if that's the case, it's in the north. The north is enemy territory, and we can't get you there. Not yet. Go and clear your head. Come find me when you're ready. Hmm? Okie dokes. I Let's just do the frickin' job for Amita. Hey, Amita. And ba Bagra? Badra? I am teaching you to protect yourself. Ah, the tourist. I'm Amita. This is Badra. Badra. Okay, got it. Look, I overreacted back there. We're at war. We keep losing soldiers. The work keeps piling up. Is there anything I can do? I'm not a soldier, but I want to help. Okay. Sure. There's a farm not far from here. Kanan runs it, but she's old, and she could use your help with some wild animals. I need you to keep the hides intact, so use this. Badra. What are you... Pick it up. Try again. Okie dokes. Fuck wolves. Oh, I've always wanted to meet Kanan. He was that rapper who made that song from the thing, the World Cup or something, right? I'm sure he'll be in this game. <laughs> Hello, farm friend. Oh, Jesus. Oh, um, hello, old woman, who I'm assuming is Kanan. You're not a rapper. Can we just. Can we. Can... Sent me over. She said you might have some kind of wild animal problem. She doesn't speak English at all. Hey, Amita, I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. <sighs> Wolves are a common nuisance for Kanan Farm. She's killed off a number of them, but this year they're especially aggressive, and I'm worried about her. There's a den nearby. Clear it out, huh? 
I think Kadan has supply stockpiled somewhere on her farm that you can use. And Ajay, skin your kills. We can always use the pelts. Okay. Let's go murder the crap out of some wolves. I don't know why I came up here. Like the view. Ah, oh, come on! He is such a freaking pussy when it comes to that kind of thing. I will be taking... Taking your skin now, thank you very much. Lovely. Okay, now, the first time I did this, I jumped into the water, which probably increased the run much, because it was fucking stupid. Now I know what the camera does, I'm not going to hold forwards to try and zoom in and then j fall off a cliff. But I really don't like looking down sights with the bow and arrow. How did that not hit? That's better. They don't care. They don't care about their brethrens. Yeah, hide in your cave. Being in a dead end is really going to save you from me. This is a lot of wolf. You're going to be able to make so many pretty necklaces. Don't bark at me. Don't bark at me. Don't judge me. You'll only end up getting yourselves killed. You're fucking wolves. What are you going to do against a man who's armed? And there's an explosive barrel in here. Which, which freaking hoarder wolf got the explosive barrel and just took it into the wolf hide? That's just asking someone to blow you the frick up. How many- do I have too many wolf skins yet? I'm just gonna go ahead and blow the thing up. Then we're all hunky-dory. Ow! Did I just kill myself? I need to- <laughs> <laughs> Hunky-dory, he says. And you know what? I don't want you to live anymore. Yep. That's it's all good in the hood. They're not going to be a problem anymore. I'm leaving. Oh, and that's here as well. I sorted everything. I'm the best around. Hello, Badra. Badra, how are you? Good. I uh, brought you these pelts. I thought maybe you could use them. Hmm. It's a good idea. You keep them. She has enough of her Tonka paintings. I'm sorry, Tonka what? This one is about the life of a guru. This one is about the demon Yalung. This one is about the goddess Kira. And that one is about Badra, the next Tarun Matara. The Tarun Matara is a living goddess, if you believe Sabal. It's no life for a child, being treated as an object, thing. <sighs> Thanks for your help. Later, I'll show you how to put those to good use. Okie dokie. I'll learn how to paint. Fly! Tuck tuck fly! <laughs> perfect. Absolutely put. Where's the tuck tuck? Tuck tuck? Ah, there you are, friend. What a lovely roof design you have. See, you never get to appreciate the design on the roof of a Tuk Tuk. Okay, now let's drive Tuk Tuk Friend to safety. What do you mean I can't drive Tuk Tuk Friend? Tuk Tuk Friend, no! Go. Probably should breathe now. Gonna pass out. Ugh. 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 This is a... This is a safe point I'm not gonna be picking up on again, so I don't know what to do. Ugh. And... Push off. That is the smallest freaking cliff. Oh, okay, it gets bigger, I guess. Okay, so, uh, this one is the story of an RJ who, uh, may or may not have been killed in an absolutely horrendous hang gliding accident where he fell to his untimely death. See you next time, guys. <laughs>